One thing I love fishing for is mackerel. No matter where you are around the tropical parts of the country, during those warmer months, the mackerel come on in great numbers. Uh, in my neck of the woods, it's generally around Christmas being southeast Queensland. But using pilchards just increases the catch rate tenfold. It's incredible. There's a certain way to do it. You don't go flat out with a pilly being swung behind the boat because it's going to fall off. They're a soft bait. But if you troll them slow, in gear, out of gear on your boat, in gear, out of gear, just so the pilly is just wallowing in the water, then dropping and then going, they're going to come up and nail it. And if you've got a pink squid on it, it's going to really increase the chances of that hookup. Here's how I do my pilchard. So unlike a standard conventional rigging up the pilly where you go in through the side like that and then through the eyelet, well, this is going underneath the bait. Now we want this bit of wire here to go up through his, under his mouth and out through the top of his nose. So we want to line it up. And I believe this is about where we're going to go now. So we'll start right down on the tail. Mackerel will and have been known just to snip the tails off like a surgeon. You know, they just come through and just bang, cut it off and you pull this bit in and it's gone. But most of the time with these particular tweed bait pillies is that they'll just want more and more so they keep coming back which is awesome and under the belly again like that this top part here just goes up through now if you do have a little nose cone what that is is basically a little cone that screws down over the wire and that'll just hold it in place which is perfect generally use them on garfish as well once you have that nose cone slid down over the top of the pilchard's head to secure him to the shank of the hook, put your skirt over. Now my skirt here, I've got a small ball sinker or a bean sinker in that as well, and that's just gonna give it a bit of weight. But there is your perfectly weighted and looking pilchard ready to go out for a mackerel. Again, in gear, out of gear. Do it really slow and it's going to really increase. Oh, and by the way, make sure you got your drag set because they hit really damn hard. Good luck.